everything's unfolding as it should And I would be more grateful if I could If the world is an image in my mind Then I can't complain about what I find Maybe I want to be taller Maybe I want to be richer But I guess when all is said and done I'm pretty happy with this picture Cause everything's unfolding as it should And I would be more grateful if I could Oh, maybe I want to be taller Maybe I want to be richer But I guess when all is said and done I'm pretty happy with this picture Cause everything's unfolding as it should And I would be more grateful if I could Hey guys, so welcome back to Freedom with Frida And today I'm taking you through an empty bedsitter apartment Is it an apartment or a house, a room, whatever you want to call it It's called a bedsitter apartment that is empty And yeah, come with me The good thing about this apartment is that it's on the top floor that means lighting is good. That means um, when you hang your clothes, because you'll be able to see the hanging lines, no one else hangs their clothes on top of yours. And this place is ever clean, very safe, walking distance to town, and it's best in Nakuru. So, what we're gonna do is we're just going right onto it. Let's get onto the house. So, come with me. As I start, I'm going to apologize and say uh, someone just moved out and so they just cleaned out so there's some water and I know people might come in easily because people prefer top floor so you'll be seeing water on the floor but on my first left is a toilet um, there's no bulb because of course no one is in uh, but there's a toilet here marble on the side really pretty and, and great because there's a window here. Hot shower, um, 24 hours. And again, water is taken care of in your bills. Like you don't pay water separately from other rent. It's taken care of. Then there's a toilet, spacious enough. The toilet is spacious enough. In case you're a couple that enjoys a showering together, you can fit here the two of you. So it's spacious enough. And I think that's pretty good, a good thing. The other thing is the toilet is outside. So like you can just lock your door and that's it. You can put a padlock and that's it. The other good thing about a toilet being outside is in case people are doing things, you know, whatever things you do in the toilet, you don't have to feel the smell <laughs> because it's a bit sitter, yes, but the toilet is somehow outside. Now, so colors here are gray cream and green onto the kitchen you'll be able to see that but hey i'm coming so Anne is behind the camera <laughs> miss g please follow her on her youtube channel check her i'll be able to link her somewhere here <laughs> and uh, coming in on your first left is a kitchen let me see there's lighting okay someone left a bun so there's a kitchen here the color is green pretty good i just love how they just painted and a kitchen crib so it's quite not so big um just enough space i would say just enough space the sink is here water running 24 hours as you can see okay then we have a window here um which again ensures lighting and ensures that you know in case all right so we have shelves on this side going around the kitchen and up to this other side so you can place your things up here 
I think the shelves are quite enough for whatever it is that you want to do in your kitchen, which is something they really did well. And they are strong enough, again, uh, going around more shelves, more shelves, even up to this other side. So you have enough storage space for your cereals, or whatever it is that you are using to cook for anything that you want to just put on your kitchen. Now let's talk about Let's talk about the kitchen space and where you can place your fridge. Uh, there's enough space. You can have your fridge. You can have your cooker. You can have... It might not leave huge space for you, but again, it's enough if you make good use of it. So, enough space. And yeah, I love the color, I think. What do you think, Miss G? I love the green. You love the green in the yeah. kitchen. Now the cool thing with these guys is they made the kitchen green, but coming onto the house now, you know, the room, it's cream in color. The good thing with this is you can always change to whatever color you want. You are allowed to do your wallpapers. And in case you're wondering how to do your wallpapers, reach out. I'm gonna leave a link here because by now you know we're doing wallpapers. So I'm going to leave you the link here. So you can figure out how you can change the outlook of your house and have your wallpaper running and having the colors that you need for your house. So the walls are uh, creamy color. Of course, there's a window as you are coming in, and then there is a window on this other side. I know you can see some lighting coming in. So this window is, and like I said, it's top proof. So literally, you can just check outside and you know. There's a road here, you can watch that, you can watch people, you can have some fun there. And then it brings enough lighting to the house, which is pretty a good thing. It's something I, I really love about the house. Now, how big is it? It's quite big. It's actually one of the biggest bed sitters I have come, um, I have come to notice or I've come to know. So, really a good. Uh, Space enough for your bed, for your seats, for everything. You can have an office in, in this bed sitter. So we have switched on this side as you come in. Light, I mean, someone was here, they left their light there, their bulb there. So again, put your switch on. It's one bulb you can definitely take care of their own house. So the switches are here as you come in. Then we have a socket right there. Basically, you can have your extension there, you can have an extra one, you know that. So as we were talking about this basically with Miss we were trying to imagine what would we do with the house, where would we keep our TV, where would we have our bed, where would we have um, the sitting area and all that. And we figured out, since this place has a kitchen and there's this partition, then this is smaller than this other side. So meaning, you can have your TV here, because if you have your bed here, it fits perfectly okay like just on to one side and to at this end and this other end so you don't have space for your outfit so if you're coming into this bed seat then i think your tv should be somewhere here or maybe just where the sockets are just a way of trying to imagine how well we put this and then this other side where uh is still standing then you come on this other side it's a bit longer because i mean the kitchen is not on this other side it's a bit longer me kidoko as you can see, so you can have your bed and have your clothes on this other side or whatever it is that you want to put here. It's spacious enough. I mean, you can occupy a six by six bed. You can have um, a six seater, I'll say five seater, sorry, and a TV, whatever it is, but it's just big enough. So, yeah. And the price is 8,000 Kenya shillings, which I think is fair enough, especially putting in consideration where it's based, like it's a walking distance to town. So pretty much good price. I mean, you don't have to pay fare to go to town. That is not cool. Let's talk about the floor. Like I mentioned, uh, we just did some cleaning. So the floor is a little wet, but it's maroon in color, is it brown? <laughs> but what they do is that every time someone leaves, they make sure they repair. So I'm sure in the next few days, they are going to um, paint some more, even the walls, they will have to paint some more so that when you're coming in, you are sure that you are getting the best law that is not, you know, so used to, so used to. But again, the person that was here really did some good job. 
So let's talk about the city for a little bit. One of the things that this guy did pretty well was the city. It's, I would say bow, I would call it wood, but it's amazing. It makes the house look really pretty, awesome, attractive. I mean, the first thing that people say when they come to these houses is, wow, the setting. So I think this guy did really an amazing job um, in the setting. And when it's raining, you don't you actually don't actually feel the raindrops for some reason. I don't know why, but somehow this makes the house look pretty beautiful. I hope you like the house. I hope you like what you're seeing. And of course, Rakuru has one of the best houses. It has one of the best bed sitters and this is one of them now let's as we walk out we'll be talking about the corridor just outside okay so come with me so as you come out this is the door to the entrance and of course the exit you want to get your seat inside the bed the door is big enough if you want to get your seat inside your bed it's easy of course you lock it um Yes, there's this space uh, down here, which is, as you come in, like I said, there's a bathroom, then there's a door. So there's space here where you can, I don't know why they didn't have a door. I was thinking they should have had a door here or something just to cover up. But what people do is they put a curtain and I'll show you an example of that. Basically, that's an example of how you can uh, put a curtain. So that's what people do here. You put a curtain on the outside. That's a case example, someone's house. So when you put a curtain there, you are able now to protect your your outside from the inside but there's this space right here that i think creates more space for you're going to the loo you can put your shoes somewhere here you can do some little decoration if you want person who just wants to have your side looking good also you can put some little decoration yeah that's basically it for it and the price is eight thousand like i said a month water inclusive of course, for electricity, you have a token, they're down there. Um, so you just fill up your token once they run out. But that's basically it. I think it's quite a good place to be in. And let me show you how you relate with the neighbors, Makumi. It's a quiet place, very quiet, not many people. But look at this, look at these guys. So clean, beautiful colors. Uh, gray and a little bit of touch of cream enough high lines so you have enough for your clothes you can have of course they put this just in case you want to have your area hanging somewhere there you are sorted every house has this so i think it's one of the houses that was really thought of before they you know built it thank you so much guys for stopping by i hope you enjoyed the video i hope um you subscribed if you haven't thank you stay positive stay focused and see you on the next one and follow me stick on youtube everything's unfolding as it should and i would be more grateful if i could if the world is an image in my mind can't complain about what I find Maybe I want to be taller Maybe I want to be richer But I guess when all is said and done I'm pretty happy with this picture Cause everything's unfolding as it should And I would be more grateful if I could Oh, maybe I want to be taller Maybe I want